my people, you are powerfully welcome to Infotech TV. As it has been our usual saying that on Infotech TV, we are highly committed and very diligent to make sure that we dish out the right update from the right source. And if you notice that over some days now, we have not been online to give you an update. Uh, we are not here just to be giving an update without that update to be an authentic update from the right source. Uh, because we are capable to give you over 100 updates in a single day. But that is not what matters most. But to give the right update from the right source, that is exactly what matters. On the current happening, on the disbursement of this grant we are talking about over some days now. And uh, uh, based on the report we received, a uh, serious meeting has been held. And uh, just of recent, another meeting, a powerful meeting also was held just some few days ago. And that is exactly what we are going to uh, watch or listen to right now, the outcome of the meeting. Because if I will tag today update, I think definitely, personally, it will be tagged as uh, a, a battle, uh, the, the, the battle line is draw and I see victory ahead. The battle line is draw and I see victory ahead. And on the issue of the protest, uh, what, is go what is going to happen on the protest? Is it protest is going to hold nationwide on the disbursement? And also, those uh, reports that have been uh, posted to the UN about the current situation on the disbursement of the grant. What is the state of things? We want to get the update right now to know what is exactly happening, to get it from, to get it hot and fresh. Not I myself to interpret what you, will, you are about to receive or you are about to listen to. The meeting that will be held and what is exactly what is going to happen on Monday. After Monday, what is, the, what, what, what is going to happen? And after Tuesday, what is, what is going to happen? Please take your time to listen to this update or watch the update wherever you are watching this Infotech TV from. Take your time to listen or watch this update. So please do not be distracted while watching or listening to this update. So stay tuned on this channel so that when more update comes, we'll be able to dish out this correct update as it comes in court. So thanks for watching on Infotech TV. Don't forget to share this update to your friends and family and to all our subscribers wherever they are. Share this update with them so that they will not be in darkness. They will be get connected and be informed on what is exactly what is about to happen and what is happening and what has happened just a few days ago. Thanks and God bless you. Good evening, Nigerians and the fellow subscribers in the grant community. We want to thank God for the new development. Yesterday, we are being carried away by some informations regards to the protest that are supposed to come up on Monday, being tomorrow, because it was today we have gotten the whole details of what is going on and why the protest was being procrastinated and postponed to Thursday. We are not informed very well and that was why we came up that yesterday to encounter it. We thought that it was this the same so-called cabas that had been frustrating things. And that was why people like us came up to encounter it. We thought that it was cabas that still tell us to wait as usual. You know, this is our noise in this country. We used to hear cabas, cabas. Now, who are those cabas? Cabas are a few people. About two or three people. They are the ones that made up those cabas. Have you sit down and ask yourself, why is it it is only this country we hear that grammar? 
presidency to tell you there are people ruling this country and some of you know what I'm talking about now we have about 200 million at least 200 million people that made up this country as citizens both the ones in diaspora both the ones in town now only few people called Kabas are the ones taking decisions holding everybody hostage frustrating everybody and if you want to talk they will threaten you if you talk you will be get arrested and everybody will keep quiet and things will begin to spoil our generation say no to that nonsense that is our noise now now they are the one controlling every human being in this country and we thought that they are the same people that told us to wait again as usual that was why we came up and said that there would be a protest on Monday. But now, we have had the whole details. We have been informed. In fact, we are now aware of what is going on. Let us respect this, our guest from diaspora. These people have come to help us for we to get this thing done. So let us respect them. I want to plead to all the subscribers, everybody calm down. Let's wait between now to that Wednesday. Everybody just calm down. Let's respect them. Let's respect them. Our protest is still intact. Let's just wait within these three days and see the outcome of things. But I pray, let them do the needful. <laughs> I pray, let them do the needful before that Thursday. Because <laughs> they will do the needful. Let's believe God. Because what is about to come, I think they want anarchy. We will give them anarchy. That anarchy, the world will give it to them. So let's pray. So everybody calm down for now. And let's give these people this respect. They will get this thing done. And everybody will laugh. Everybody will relax. Everybody will enjoy. So thank you. I'm here to announce to the subscribers. No more protest on Monday. That protest is cancelled and postponed for now. Please, let's just wait and see the outcome of things. Thank you. I remain comrade Favor, known as High Tension. Thank you. We strongly believe that this promise that we should give them three, two, three days that something will happen. And if not, we will certainly go ahead with what we have planned. That is in that aspect. So the people involved, these influential people, some of these international something involved, they are not people that we that we that we talk with us, that we take things with levity. That is that. Now, on the part of uh, what's it called? Umakama, sir. There are a lot of stories. If you have been following us, there are a lot of stories that surround this program, this thing. As we speak, God is helping us to win. We don't want to come out play. God is helping us to win. And we are willing. I repeat again, we are willing. We are willing. God is on our side. We are willing. The person involved has deceived Nigeria. But God is stronger and mightier than Geophilus Ologe Eboi. And we are winning. So, whoever is supporting all of those.
the supporters, the issue of the what's it, the West not released today, the work released by all of the his armies, forget about all those, they are just ordinary noise speaker. We are winning. No matter how sad first first food must have gone in life, truth will certainly what's it called? Overcome, outrun that first food that have gone for several years. We repeat on you, we are winning with what we are saying. So that is that. Now, on the issue of Ken talking to Nigeria, that is sad, that why is he saying this all the while? We, we want to let you know today, subscribers in the house, that the silence of Ken Wakama is golden. His silence is golden. And his silence is paving way for us. Very soon, you will, you will, you will, you will be on the list. Very soon, you will know that his silence is golden. His silence is golden. I think I want to stop and so that the moderator will continue. So for now, it is not that Ken Wakama is a fool. It is not as if he's a dummy, as some of you, some of some persons who are not before outside here. The way they take it to be, that why has he been silenced all the while? There are reasons behind that. And very soon, Nigeria will know. So let me stop by this and let the moderator, the secretary, take over. Thank you very much. Uh, thank you so much. Uh, I want to stop. Thank you, Jack Smoney here. And for the fact that it's money here, we cannot give it up on this money. The people that are, they want to sit up on this money, they do not have two heads. They have only one head. And it's, and it's a woman on them the way the woman on us. Are you hearing me? They have hypnotized so many people in the system of this country. And they have traumatized the Nigerian masses with fear. Why I want to repeat this in again. Why would say that fear is a terrible sin is a traitor and is a sin. And I thank God the way the streets or the, the masses you you people have risen up. As a matter of living the world, trying to uh, control so many people. So many people, our brother today, our colleague released a voice of today, um, in consideration of the people that have begun to book flight tickets already. Whether there is a meeting we have from starting from 4 a.m. today. That lasted for hours. Now, those authorities that have come into so many of them is in the country already. We have two principalities in the country already dealing with the governments, looking for the documents, <clears throat> going after the documents, and verifying so many things and telling us. Now, they have told us that they want us to wait. Forgive them Monday, Tuesday, Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. That if they do not deliver, if they do not push this thing to happen, then on Thursday they will join us. Let Nigerian government and all of them that are set about test the rocks and let the they the, 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 the medical, the medical medicine. We have people, and now they told us to wait, let them do their own. If they do within Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and this time will tear resist them, then they will join us, giving us international backup, both for security and everything. I hope you people are listening well. Because why? We know them. We want, we, want it, we want this program to be on Monday, but we have begun to read the system, what they want to do. If we come out, they want to use talks to be able to hijack this protest, to do so many things so that it will turn otherwise. But right now, intelligent men of our international security men and all that have come in, telling us that they are on top of this matter and we should give them only three days to deliver. When they go to the Mr. President and all of them that call themselves Kaba and tell them deliver this thing right now to the hand of the um, masses of Nigeria that has suffered so much for this and they can't refuse. These people have told us that they will bring international forces which they command because we have one of them that is a commander of forces, of forces from America and otherwise and all African wives. The man of Russia's was the habitual anger over what is going on. They said that they will come into it, follow us in the protest, protect us, protect everybody that is involved, 